The only problem is how to get close enough without being spotted. One of the older mothers leads the attack. In the confusion of the stampede, one of the lionesses manages to grab a wildebeest. Others soon rush to help. But some are more interested in helping themselves. As the dominant male, Scar gets to eat first. He needs to be on top form to protect the pride. He heard the kill from an incredible distance, at least a, a kilometre away, about half a mile away, and he's coming in at a run. Now forced to rely on his own offspring to support him, this is indeed the only place where Scar is still the dominant male. After three years at the top, Scar's control of the Marsh Pride is looking really shaky. Just as he and Scruffy had once taken over the Pride, his own leadership is about to be challenged. It had to happen sooner or later. The marsh has attracted some new lions, tough, dangerous lions at that. They've been hanging around the area for weeks, but when they finally start to walk right into the heart of the marsh pride territory, it seems like nothing can stop them. Scar is nowhere in sight. Considering they're on foreign territory, these boys don't look too nervous. Quite the contrary, they're fit, strong, and looking to expand their horizons. It's obvious the local hyenas don't know these heavyweights either, because they're running in to challenge them. Not a wise move. Adult male lions take no nonsense. These two males want to make it absolutely clear who's boss. This is a statement, a clear signal to all the hyenas and any lion onlookers that these males mean business. It may look extreme to our eyes, but it's what these guys are built for. The new males immediately start to strut around, as if they own the place. This does not look good for our young lions, especially the males, who won't be welcomed here. Some of the young females, however, are intrigued. They're torn between caution and curiosity. After all, 
these fit males could be just what they're looking for to help defend cubs in the future. As far as fidelity in lion society is concerned, it just depends who's toughest. On this occasion though, the girls are having none of it. But the fact remains that these males could muscle into the marsh at any time. Ultimately, that may not be a bad thing for the females, but the young males could be in mortal danger. <laughs> 